Nate Berkus and Jeremiah Brandt are a dynamic duo on and off screen. The designer couple are best known for starring on the hit HGTV series Nate and Jeremiah by Design and the Nate and Jeremiah Home Project and have given many glimpses of their love story over the years. After tying the knot in 2014 at the New York Public Library, the couple has since welcomed two children, a daughter named Poppy and a son named Oscar. We are each other's biggest cheerleader, Brent, who recently joined the cast of Queer Eye, previously told people about their long-lasting marriage. Here's everything to know about Berkus and Brent's relationship. Their first date was antique shopping. Though the couple ran in similar circles, sparks didn't fly until years after their first meeting. To be honest, Nate had a serious boyfriend the first time, we met. I had a lot of boyfriends. The timing was just never really right like that, Brent told HGTV about why they didn't initially get together. It wasn't until about three years later that they reconnected at Rachel Zoe's birthday party in New York City. During the party, Berkus approached Brent about going antique shopping, and the rest is history. I was sitting in a brown leather chair and we were just talking. And I remember thinking to myself, oh god, what is this? This is not what I thought it was, Brent recalled of their first date. There was something about him that, in his presence, I just felt so safe. I would say it was within 15 minutes. I'll never forget it, Berkus added. It wasn't because of the conversation, it was just this huge energy shift and we both felt it at the same time. Nate proposed at Machu Picchu. Less than a year after their first date, Berkus popped the question in Peru atop the famed Machu Picchu in April 2013. I've known since our first date that Jeremiah was who I wanted to spend the rest of my life with, Berkus later told people about their engagement. Their wedding was a historic moment. On May 4, 2014, Berkus and Brent tied the knot at the New York Public Library, becoming the first same-sex couple to hold their wedding at the iconic New York landmark. The wedding was officiated by Sherry Salata, the former co-president of Oprah Winfrey Network, and featured 220 guests, including their longtime friend Oprah Winfrey, Rachel Ray, Katie Lee, Rebecca Minkoff, Irene Neuwirth, Busy Phillips and Elizabeth Hendrickson from The Young and the Restless. Since tying the knot, the couple has welcomed two children together, a daughter named Poppy and a son named Oscar. Speaking with people in May 2022, Brent said he thought he was never going to have kids until he met Berkus. Within 10 minutes, I wanted to create a life and a family with him, he explained. And it was the first time that I really believed that we could and I could. He was the first person that made me feel safe enough to go, okay, we can do this together. They welcomed their daughter Poppy Brent Berkus via surrogate on March 23, 2015. We are so excited to finally be a family of three. As anyone with a newborn knows, we have our work cut out for us but couldn't be happier to be embarking on this life-changing journey that is parenthood, Berkus wrote on Facebook at the time of her birth. Their son, Oscar Michael Brent Berkus, was born via surrogate on March 26, 2018. The couple chose the name Oscar to honor Berkus' former partner Fernando Bengochia, who died tragically in the 2004 Sri Lankan tsunami, Oscar was Bengochia's middle name. We have always honored Fernando's memory in our relationship. He's a part of our love story, Brent told People. It's such an important chapter in Nate's life. So the idea that we can honor his memory in a beautiful way was exciting to us. They are each other's biggest cheerleaders.